I can smell the sulfur. Can you smell it, Simulus? Yes. I wasn't going to say anything. Warning! Warning! Life forms approaching! Which direction? From all directions. 50 meters away. Why don't I see anything? Unknown. Now 40 meters away and still closing. 35. 30. They must be invisible. 25. I still don't see anything. Nine meters. Where are they? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two meters, one meter. They're here. They're here. The crash must have messed up her circuitry. She's clearly malfunctioning. Somebody's got me. Grab hold of something. What would you suggest? Ah, I told you there were oh. life forms. The adventures of Captain Zoom in outer space will continue. <laughs> Hurry up, kid. <laughs> so I guess you're not mad at me anymore. No, not now that I have you all to myself. Uh, look, Vesper, I, I don't want to give you the wrong impression. We, we had some fun, we shared some laughs. And I gave up a sacred gift for you. And it's not that I don't appreciate the sacrifice, it's just that uh -huh. I, I'm just not ready to settle down with one high priestess. What are you trying to say to me? Uh, do you know how much longer is this going to take? I was done a while ago. I was just listening. Uh. Hey, somebody help me. Anybody. What happened to Mumina? Where's Karen Simulus? I don't know. I can't remember. Bailey, help me. What's wrong with her? She's had a sensory overload. It's affected her memory bank. Well, just slap her on the back. That's what I do with my TV. Illumina, try audio playback. <laughs> That's true. Uh, How would you know that? Oh, they're in trouble. <laughs> what do we do? How can we find them, Bailey? I can reprogram the luminous sensors so she can lead us to where they disappeared. Look, I don't want to end up dead. I say we should just let the kid fix the rocket and let's get out of here. Well, she's got a point. It is written that if someone chooses to live as a coward, he chooses not to live. It is also written that a certain old woman with no fashion sense should butt out. We can't just give up. We have to at least try, don't we? Listen, Bailey. You want someone to entertain the troops, I'm your man. But leading rescue missions, fighting alien horns... Hey, I'm just wrong for the part. So you're not a hero? Just Monday through Friday, 4.30 to 5 Eastern Time. So that's it? You're just gonna abandon my sister and my best friend? Just leave them out there to die? You're right. You're not the defender of the universe. You're not the promised one. You're nothing. You know, Bailey, nobody talks to Ty Farrell like that. I am a big star, and I have my own TV show. And everybody's always telling me how great I am. Oh, terrific work, Ty. You look fabulous, Ty. I don't know how you do it, Ty. And you know what? After a while, you start to believe it. But deep down, you know the truth. And you're right, kid. I am nothing. And I have some work to do in my character. Let's go save your sister, kid. Perfect. Stuck in the wilderness with the wrong pair of shoes. My sensors indicate this is where our comrades were attacked. Good. Then we should learn from their mistakes and leave. Now, on Illumina's recording, it sounded like they were being dragged away. Then why aren't I picking up any tissue traces along the ground? 
Perhaps they weren't dragged along the ground. What do you mean? Oh, don't fall for her act. She doesn't know. In religion school, they teach us to answer a question with a question that makes us sound wise. Wait a minute. I think Sang is on to something. I'm picking up a maze of tunnels underneath us. If they were dragged underground, we wouldn't pick up any traces. Is there an entrance? A hundred meters in that direction. Good work, Sega. She didn't do anything. I've never heard of an underground race. There's nothing written about one in Pangean scripture. Guess we don't know everything then, do we? I just wish they'd get to the light so we can see what we're up against. Sometimes it's better not to know. Keeps you from thinking twice. I say we move in and hope for the best. Oh, yeah, what are we waiting for? We've got an old woman, a bratty kid, a screwed up robot, an ego mad womanizer. These guys don't stand a chance. Look, nobody asked you to come along, and don't you ever call my Bailey a brat. Oh, and I'm supposed to listen to a trash can that talks. Perhaps if you would listen, you'd learn something. Oh, please. You tell her, Sagan. Enough. You're gonna find Tyrant Simulus. Who are you people? What do you want from us? I asked you a question. Who are you? Don't you want something to eat? Not if it's what they had. Hmm? Here. Eat. Leave it alone. No one should ever see what Fox's tortures did to me. Someone who can't see. No. You're so big and powerful, but in your face I feel such kindness. Love. My guess is the Terran simulus are locked up in the cells. We're gonna have to bust them out. What is your plan? We'll light a small fire, we'll generate as much smoke as possible. And in the confusion, we'll rescue Tyrion Simulus. We'll be gone before the smoke clears. Do you think it'll work? Sure, we did it every season. That's the only decent diversion the writers came up with. <laughs> it would have worked. I mean, who knew they didn't need eyes to see? <laughs> hey, careful, buddy. This costume was designed by two-time Oscar winner Ian Payne. See you, I thought I was gonna have to fight one of these people. Prepare to die, Captain. Simmons! I'm not forcing her out! Somebody could get hurt! You catch on quickly. Oh great. You're excellent with the sword, Captain. Some of the best deals in Hollywood. Uh, I made on the tennis court. Uh, had enough? Uh, Simulus, what's gotten into you? If I kill you, they'll let me live among them. Oh, this is wonderful. And they seem like such nice people. Uh, you don't understand. In this land of the sightless. I'm not hideous. But I don't think you're hideous. That's because I've never shown you my face. 
All those who've seen it are repulsed. But you're judging me without giving me a chance. I won't be repulsed. That's what you have to do, huh? Hey, maybe they'll let you kill the others, too. The people who accepted you, who never asked you to murder anybody just to prove your loyalty. a show for you people. If you want to see Captain Zoom fight, buy a TV set. Zoom? Promised one, great Rhea instructed us to prepare for your arrival. We have waited uncounted lifetimes. Captain, these must be the gatekeepers. Uh, is, is, is that true? Uh, can, you, can you tell us uh, uh, the directions to the temple of Rhea? Is there another Captain Zoom? lead you no further. None of us has ever been beyond this point. It is written, only the promised one will return from the voyage. The promised one and his friends, right? Thank you, oh promised one, for allowing us to fulfill our destiny. I thought it was a big deal when I was Grand Marshal of the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. <laughs> you know, this boat doesn't really look big enough. I'll stay here. You are welcome here, sister. <laughs> On second thought, let the kid and his girlfriend stay. Hey! No, Bailey, she's right. It's too dangerous. I will come back for you. I know you will. You know, if it's really gonna be that dangerous... Sit! thought I'd live to see it. The coming of the promised one. Memorized by the first high priestess of Pangaea and handed down to each of her successors. So this is where it is written. It is written. You really are the promised one. I knew it. 
I prophesized it first. How could this be? I, I mean, this can't. That's me. Didn't get the chin quite right. But that's me. How could this happen? The passage of time was an obsolete concept to the ancients. They were the masters of the past and of the future. But come on, of all the people in the universe, they choose me? My old man said I never meant anything. <laughs> Which way? Let's go to the left. That's the direction our scripture's always written from. Which direction does the promised one want to go in? The promised one says that way. Who am I to doubt the promised one? Is ending. You made the right choice, Captain. Of course I made the right choice. I am the promised one. The adventures of Captain Zoom in outer space will return in a moment. choice, Captain. The promised one does not appreciate sarcasm. Come. We must find the Temple of Rhea. Right. We have a prophecy to fulfill. Huh? I say we go that way. Uh, Captain, perhaps we should just go up these stairs? The promised one concurs. Would you stop calling yourself that? What? It's written. Careful. The house of the great god, Rhea. Could use a little landscaping. Hey, wait. I've seen these doors before. In your dreams? N no, no, in my TV show. It, it looks like the set of the episode I was doing when Bailey brought me here. Remember the words. I didn't need cue cards. All I had to do was remember how to say Chaco, Saco, is Boffo backwards. Chaco, Saco? Rhea. 
From him we will attain the power to free our people. Or... Go, let's go! The power to enslave your people? Depending on how you look at it. Excuse me, excuse me. How did you find us? Oh, I would alter my unceremoniously defract high priestess. I knew you were a traitor. We should have left you floating in space. I didn't lead him here, I swear. Of course you did, my darling. Your Vectron amulet is a tracking device. <laughs> You've got to believe me, I didn't know. I don't worry about it, Vesper. They won't shun you for long. You'll all be dead in a moment. <laughs> Doesn't Lord Vox prefer to torture and mutilate his victims before killing them? You seem familiar, but I can't place the face. Perhaps you'd remember me if I was screaming in agony as your torturer seared the skin off my face with a white-hot scalpel. Sorry, that doesn't really help narrow it down. Now, let's see. Who has pissed me off the most? That would be you, my love. However, I'll give you one last chance to share my throne. I would rather die a thousand deaths. Well, let me help you get started. Run to Temper, temper, Captain. I've spared your life this long. Don't make me kill you before we've finished. What do you mean, spared my life this long? For years, I've studied the ancient legends of Pangaea. I could have laid waste to the planet years ago. But how could I risk destroying some vital clue to its secrets? Then came Captain Zoom. Dear Captain Zoom. When you stole my Vespa's purity, I knew then that you were fulfilling prophecy. I simply sat back and let you lead me to the grand prize. The power of rare. And now, I shall give you all the opportunity to witness my coronation. Coronation? Oh, dear Tira. With the power of rare, I can subjugate the weak and destroy all those who will not bow down before me. will use their blood to paint a pathway of fear across the universe. You're looking at the next, the first emperor of everything! Can't decide, huh? Guess somebody didn't study his ancient legends hard enough. Is it the sword? 
or the scroll? Which one will help you subjugate the weak or kill all those fools who don't bow down before you? Is it the sword box or is it the scroll? Hurry, Ray doesn't have all day. <laughs> now, if it was me... Will you shut up? Fine, just try now. It's the sword. <laughs> You're trying to trick me. You said that so I won't take the sword. <laughs> the power of Rhea. And it is mine! I'm gonna be sick. 